Good morning, my peeps. Good morning, and I love you. Happy Saturday. We're up relatively early. It's about 8.30, and Glenn's going to get started on the deck and edging the yard, and I've got to get dressed and get out to the store and get a few things. And it's early enough where the carpenter bee is not awake yet, so I can enjoy my deck for a little bit. <laughs> But I just wanted to tell you guys that I love you and hope you have an awesome Saturday. Talk to you in a little bit. And away we go, guys, and away we go. We're off to the races already. So I'm gonna hop in here to Walgreens, uh, grab a couple things. I've gotta get to Publix, I gotta get to the meat store. And I want to see if they have that strawberry cake this time. And Allie said something about their ugly cake. I don't know. I didn't like it. She said she loved it and she ate the whole thing by herself. So I don't know. I got to get gas. The beat goes on, as I always say. So let's get this day started. And remember, I love you. Talk to you in a little bit. Finally back, guys. This is the carnage. The rest of it stayed in the garage. And Glenn's already treated the deck with the chemicals to clean it. It's looking really nice. And once that dries up, next comes the stain. Hoping he can get it done today, but it's already noon. So we'll see. <laughs> Let me get that chicken marinating so we have something for dinner and not repeat the mistakes of yesterday. See you in a little bit. I know it's loud in here, guys, but I've got another project I've been putting off forever, as you can see, and that's uh, washing my makeup brushes. So I've got everything out to do it, and I bought, um, I saw online that the people are recommending Zote, Z-O-T-E, it's like a laundry soap. It was only a dollar at La Unica, where I got my cooking wine. So I'm going to use this and try it out and wash my brushes and get everything ready before I um, have to redo my nails, because they're a wreck already, so if I'm going to be doing stuff like this, do it while my nails are wrecked. <laughs> And Glenn's resting, guys. That chemical has to actually sit for 24 hours, and he wants to sand the deck before he stands it, so that's going to wait, too. All right, let me get started on this project, and then it's going to be time for dinner. So let's go. And here it is guys so this is what I've got cleaned and drying I got a few of them drying down here I don't really like to leave them drying flat that isn't really the best for brushes but no more would fit in my little brush tree there still got these to wash and these to wash but pretty good that Zote soap worked pretty good I have to admit and it 
smells wonderful, so. <laughs> All right, another project down. Time to eat. Well, here's the chicken. It's been marinating all day in Moho and Worcestershire, you know, my standard combo. And I'm going to keep it simple, guys. I'm just going to make some rice aroni with it and some green beans with it, and that's going to be dinner. So Glenn had to run an errand and pick up some drum stuff in Greenville. The traffic was terrible. So we're starting a little later than I thought. It's almost 6. But let's go ahead and get started now, so hopefully we can get to eating within the hour. <laughs> Here we go. And finally, the strawberry cake, guys. They had it, and the timing was perfect because the guy was unloading the cakes that he'd driven down from, uh, or up, I should say, from Anderson. So good. And thanks to Debbie for introducing us to these cakes. Now we're hooked on them. <laughs> but anyway, guys, gonna have a piece of cake, a little cafe, and call it a night. Remember that I love you, and I'll see you in the morning for Sunday Sunday. Good night.